In this video, we're going to be having a look at a service manager feature called Snippets. I'm going to start by going to the request list and opening up one of our existing incidents. Now, one of the methods for communicating with the customer is through our email action item. By selecting this, this will automatically populate the customer's email as the recipient, and we just have to then fill in the email message. Now, sometimes you may want to be able to supply a standard response as part of this communication. And this is where the snippets comes in. So here we have our snippets option. And by selecting this, I can see the snippets that are available for myself, snippets that are available for the service that I support, and uh, ones that are available for the different teams that I'm a member of. Clicking on the manage allows me to go in and then modify some of these snippets. So we see the first two snippets here are my snippets. And down the bottom, we have a shared snippet that has been shared by Daniel Matthews. I'm just going to click on the called and left voice message snippet. And here we see the text that will be inserted into the body of the email. But we also have an option to be able to insert variables as, as part of this. So I'm just going to select the customer's first name and their last name. And then I want to include myself as the owner of this incident down at the bottom. So I'm just going to select the owner name. And lastly, I'm just going to include the reference number for this particular issue. Now, as this uh, snippet is used, these variables will be resolved and uh, these will be populated with the information from the actual request. Now, we can also share this. We see this is currently shared to two specific teams, but I can have it also shared out to any other users that support the services as well. I'm just going to update this snippet. And then I'm going to go back to our email action. And I can browse through to that snippet that was shared to the teams. And we can see here that the variables have been now populated with Anna Bishop, the customer, the reference ID, and myself as the owner of the incident.